you are listening to Passport Talks, a podcast on how to become a true cosmopolitan, how to travel the world without visas, create a safe haven for your family, and access top-notch education and healthcare with a second passport or residency. 11 Best Caribbean Islands for Investing in Real Estate Caribbean countries offer a compelling mix of safety, affordability, and lifestyle benefits making them attractive for a plan B. With real estate investments of $200,000 or more, investors can access citizenship by investment programs. Let's explore the best Caribbean island states for investing in real estate. The first is St. Kitts and Navas. The country pioneered the world with a citizenship by investment program in 1984. Investors can choose between purchasing shares in government approved properties, like five-star hotels for $400,000, or investing at least $400,000 in an approved private home. The property holding period is seven years. Investors can earn a 5% annual profit from property leasing. Unlike other Caribbean states, St. Kitts and Nevis allows property purchase for personal use without rental obligations. Property costs are relatively high, with a three-bedroom apartment averaging $4,300 per month. However, the country boasts a robust annual rental yield of 4-5% and property price growth of 4-5% per year. Oceanfront villas start at $350,000, with prices per square meter averaging $190,000. Secondly, investing in real estate in Antigua and Barbuda offers citizenship and rental income opportunities, with an annual yield of around 4%. Property prices grow by 3-5% annually, and citizenship allows resale after five years or rental income. The average cost of renting a three-bedroom apartment is $4,000, and citizenship requires investments starting at $200,000. Property prices range from $5,000 to $8,000 per square meter, with options including small villas up to $2 million and oceanfront apartments from $1 million. Antigua and Barbuda's citizenship program limits property types to government-approved options, allowing two sales per property after five years. The third is Grenada, which offers safety, beautiful beaches, and a citizenship by investment program. Investors can secure citizenship by buying real estate starting at $220,000 with an annual rental yield of 4.3%. The CBI process is remote, allowing online property selection. Rental income is an option, though slightly less profitable than in other Caribbean countries. Property prices for citizenship qualification range from $3,000 to $5,000 per square meter, with options to buy individual properties or shares in complexes starting at $220,000. Granada is home to S. George's University with a strong healthcare system boasting nine hospitals. Affordable living includes city center two-bedroom apartment rentals starting at $1.600 per month. Dominica, known as the Pearl of the Caribbean, offers an affordable citizenship by investment program with real estate investments starting at $200,000. Investors can rent out properties or sell them after just three years. Rental costs in Dominica are the lowest in the Caribbean, averaging $2,300 per month for a three-bedroom apartment. Approved properties for citizenship start at $3,000 per square meter with resale options available. Living in Dominica offers tranquility amid lush landscapes and stunning sea views. The country boasts over 60 schools, including branches of prestigious universities. Healthcare is accessed through other Caribbean islands. The fifth, St. Lucia, offers citizenship by investment in real estate, starting at $200,000 with a five-year return period and an additional non-refundable state fee of $30,000. With over 1 million annual tourists, Rental properties yield 3, 5% annually. Monthly rents for a three-bedroom apartment are the lowest in St. Lucia at $2,300. Apartments range from $400,000 for one or two bedrooms to $3 million for seaside villas. Living costs are affordable, with a single person spending $400 monthly, excluding rent, and a family of four expecting to spend $1,000 in St. Lucia. The sixth is the Bahamas. Investing in the stable real estate market of the Bahamas offers significant potential profitability, with 9 million annual tourists driving demand. Rental properties yield approximately 8% annually, appealing to high net worth individuals. 
While the Bahamas serves as a tax haven, real property tax rates vary based on property value. Real estate prices start at $3 million, influenced by demand and location. For instance, Grand Bahama offers more affordable properties starting at $300,000. However, living costs in the Bahamas are approximately 30% higher than in the U.S., excluding rent. The next is the Cayman Islands, renowned as an international tax haven. The country offers a stable economy and luxury resort properties similar to the Bahamas. With annual rental yields reaching up to 8%, real estate investments provide profitable returns. Property prices start at $400,000 for a two-bedroom apartment and $3 million for a condominium influenced by demand and proximity to beaches. Residents enjoy a luxurious lifestyle with a family of four typically spending no less than $5,000 per month, excluding rent. Jamaica and Barbados boast some of the Caribbean's priciest real estate, starting at $2,000 per square meter, appealing to affluent tourists and offering lucrative investment opportunities. While they lack citizenship by investment programs, Barbados requires permission for foreign property buyers, while Jamaica imposes no restrictions. Alternatively, the Dominican Republic offers more affordable options, starting at $100,000 for a two-bedroom apartment, remaining popular despite its lower pricing compared to Jamaica and Barbados. Lastly, St. Vincent and the Grenadines offer some of the Caribbean's most affordable real estate, with prices starting at $1,100 per square meter. However, while cheaper properties may be attractive, they may not offer the same benefits as those qualifying for citizenship by investment programs. That's it for this episode about Caribbean states for investing in real estate. Visit ImmigrantInvest.com for detailed information about them and other options for investing and obtaining second citizenship, or book a meeting with Immigrant Invest lawyers who can help answer tricky questions. Take the next step towards your global opportunities and secure your future with Immigrant Invest. And see you in the next episodes of Passport Talks. You are listening to Passport Talks, a podcast on how to become a true cosmopolitan, how to travel the world without visas, create a safe haven for your family, and access top-notch education and healthcare with a second passport or residency.